name's Nigel. What's your name? Nigel. Ania Dash. Ania Dash. Servant of God. Yes. Seven. Oh, it means servant of God. Yes. Ania Dash. Yes, servant that's, of God. That's, yeah. All right. Nice meeting you, sir. Nice so, you. Uh, one question for you. Uh, what are your thoughts on the afterlife? Afterlife, we are eternal. We are eternal. The soul is eternal. Okay. So it's it's like uh, like you're in a room mm. and you see a bird flying through a window. And okay. you're standing here, you watch the bird, and the bird exits the window and leaves the room. Okay. So the bird is like the soul. The bird existed before, before it came in the room, and the bird exists after it leaves the room. Okay, so the so spirit the soul, is like the soul, the bird, yeah. which is coming you, through a room and passing yeah. the other side. We come in this body, oh. we inhabit this body for a certain length of time, and okay. then we leave. All right, okay, so where do we go? That depends on two two things. Hmm. One is our desire, and the other is our qualification. Qualification and desire. Just like a, an example is, you may want to, you may want to drive a Rolls Royce, but you're only qualified. You're only qualified to, to drive a, you know, a, a Mini or something. Okay. So same way, qualification and desire. You have to desire to want something higher than than just a material body. You want to desire God. You want to desire to serve God. You desire to serve God, mm. and you and, and and during your lifetime, you perform activities dedicated towards serving God. Then there is a possibility when you leave your body, you will go back to be with God. Okay, so you say there is an afterlife. Definitely, there is an afterlife. Heaven and hell. Heaven and hell. Yes. You believe yes, in that? Yes. Yeah. Okay. If you die today, where are you going? If you die today, where are you going? That I cannot say. This God alone will know that. We we, we believe. And you you, you when look you in say this. Gods, how many gods are there? There's only one God. Sorry, There's not only gods. God, okay. Only one God. There's only one God. Okay. So if you die today, you don't know where you're going. I can't say. That's in the hands of the Lord, isn't it? We can we can desire. We can try our best. But up to ultimately, it's in the hands of the Lord. So. Okay. And uh, which book do you use to about the afterlife? Because if you say. It's up to God. At the moment, you say you are doing something for this God, but you are not sure as well if you are going to make it or not. Uh, <laughs> but everything, I, everything is due to the mercy of, of God, the mercy of the Lord. The mercy. Yeah, we, we are mercy of God. You, you, you may strive so hard, hmm. but the thing is to please try and please God. Hmm. If God is pleased with you, then everything will come to you. So how do you know if he's pleased with you? You have to try and follow the scriptures, follow the saintly persons, what they instruct. So we, you ask what scripture, um, in, in, in Sanskrit language in India, ancient India, Sanskrit language, there are many, many volumes. Okay. You know, we, we have the Bible, we have the Quran, we have um, various scriptures in this world, um, Buddhist scriptures. But if you look at the, the Vedic scriptures, Ved, the word Veda is a Sanskrit word meaning knowledge. So in the Vedic scriptures, there, there are vast numbers of books. Okay. And, and some of them deal with, a lot of them deal with how to live peacefully and prosperously in this world. Mm -hmm. You know, art, architecture, mathematics, mm -hmm. agriculture, medicine, mm -hmm. you know, everything that we need in this world to live a peaceful, happy, successful life, that is there in the Vedas. But the ultimate message of the Vedas is this is not our home. Mm. Our home is in, in the kingdom of God. Okay, is it the kingdom of God? Okay, me, I'm a Christian, and uh, I also like to talk to people and hear their thoughts. Now, uh, in what you believe now, how does your sin get uh, dealt with? How do you deal with sin? Well, the, the, because the, the Bible says yeah. sin separates us yeah. from God. That's right. So if there is sin, no yeah. one will enter that's, heaven. That's it. That's it. So, so the, how well, do you do with sin? Well, the first thing the Lord Jesus he he, he told his followers, particularly that one lady in the in the New Testament, he said, "Go and sin no more." So the first thing you have to know is try and reduce your sinful activities. So you told him, go and see no more. Sin no well, what, more. what did you do first before you told well, him to go we, and see no more? Well, the, the Lord came and he, if you, you know better than me, because you were a student of the, of, of the, the New Bible. Testament. Mm -hmm. But um, we, we, are, we are taught in, in our, um, how we follow the, the Vedic scriptures um, from, our, from our spiritual teachers. Yeah. We, we follow four basic principles. Mm. Uh, one is uh, we're vegetarian. No, no killing of animals, no meat, fish, or eggs. Uh, second one is no illicit sex. That means only within marriage. Third one is um, no intoxication. 
So no meat, no um, uh, you know, wine, no cigarettes, no drugs. And the fourth one is no gambling. No gambling. No gambling. So we we see these basically as like the the pillars, the pillars, the pillars of sinful activity. Okay. And if you follow so all of them, if you follow, yeah. Okay. If we, if we follow those four basic principles, we we reduce our sinful activities. You know, we're still going to walk on ant, ants. You know, we're still going to kill. In, you know, when we uh, grow food in the fields, we grow, we kill. So the, the the second most important thing is you purify your heart by taking the name of God. Then that will purify the desire for sinful activity. You you can give up. Okay. So before you go to all those things, how do you deal with sin in the first place? The the first thing we just pray to the mercy for the mercy of the Lord. We 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 understand from the scriptures that the the most purifying thing in the universe is the name of God. God and His name are non different. Okay. So me as a Christian, the Bible says there is one one thing that can only deal with sin. Do you know what it is from the Bible? You tell me. It says Jesus yeah. came to die for the sins oh. of the world. Jesus is the only one who can take away sin. So well, if Jesus is coming as a religious teacher and he is coming to establish Christianity, then he's saying there is only one way to be with the Father for eternity. Uh, well, why we we also accept there is only one way, and that is through the saintly persons, but the sons of God. Okay, we 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 say that. How many sons of God are they? Well, ultimately, we are all sons of God. We're all children of God. Okay, in but this world. but but Jesus, when he came, he said, "I am the way, the mm -hmm. truth, and the life." So, if Jesus is coming and he is proving his so message if Jesus, by dying, if, if Jesus if Jesus is to come today, yeah, then we have to follow. So Jesus may come but, but in, the Lord already, may come in, God's representatives, prophets, but, but, they, they come in different forms. You may not recognize, if Jesus came today, who, how many people would even recognize him? Okay, so I'll finish by this so that I will leave you. Jesus, he has already come. When he came, he proved his message by not only leaving it, he died and he rose from the dead. So, so he can be trusted. Um, All other religious leaders, they died. And they are still dead. Well, so they are still they, they, dead. There, are there are many different scriptures with, with different uh, histories similar to that. If you look at the Vedic scriptures, so many vast stories similar to what what you're telling me. So the the, the point is this: Krishna the point died is, and rose from the dead. Yeah, Krishna, Krishna, the, Krishna is is the eternal supreme person. Krishna doesn't die. Krishna is eternally existing, as as we are. Yeah, we are also eternal existing. Oh, okay. But but what, what, the last thing I'll say: yes, there are many different religions. So we're not saying you must you must give up Christianity and 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 become Hare Krishna or give up Islam and become you know Hare Krishna. What we're asking is that you understand your soul, you that the real person is an eternal servant of God. And whether you follow the path of Christianity or Islam, you dedicate your life to but, serving, but, but, but developing but yes, your the relationship with God. If you follow the teachings, let's say let, let me pick an example. Let's say for example Islam. Islam came with a message that opposes what, what Jesus taught. Islam denies that they're, Jesus died for the sins of the people. They're, 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 so, so one is a free will to take that or to say, no, I will take what Jesus said. Because the reason why I'm saying Jesus can be trusted is that he died and he rose from the dead. You and see, until now, yeah. he's still alive. The thing is, if I'm, if you're, I'm speaking to you as a yes. Christian, uh, if I was speaking to a, a Muslim, he would come out with something you know a different not exactly what you're saying but he would come out also and come and tell me the same thing no only islam is the only way and all other religions are false and you have a free will to get all the books so that you can check who can be trusted because the message of jesus yeah. the eyewitness well, I, I, I have i was brought up with the bible so my friend have you read bhagavad gita I'll tell I, you one I, scripture. I, 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 i've read i've read Bhagavad Gita. Yeah, I've Bhagavad read. Gita. As it and, and, and I've seen that even when they speak of Krishna, the name to say it is Christos, and uh, uh -huh. I, I, I've, I've looked at it. Good, that's fine. Yeah. So you've found your religion, so you stick with your religion, and you purify, purify your heart that way. If you have love, if you have love for the Lord, for God, you'll have love for every living creature, every living entity. Uh, so that's basically what, what we're asking. We're not asking you, please give up Christianity. For, 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 for me, it was not to say. Uh, just uh, to say leave what you are believing no what i wanted to know is how does sin get dealt with in what well, you are believing because 
Christianity, yeah. Jesus says, yeah. I'm coming to die on the cross for the sins of the people. Now, if you can have all the four pillars that you trust, no sex, no this, no that, but don't be deceived. You have because to purify your heart at the same time. You have to give up the desire. Deal with sin. The desire yeah. But dealing yeah. with desire yeah, yeah. or okay the God, desires, The name of God is so powerful that it can burn up everything to ashes. Every sinful desire, previous sins, the name of God is so powerful. So, so then God there was so no powerful. need for Jesus to come on the cross. Jesus came and he saved his followers. That's a fact. Are you one of his followers? I try to be. We are, my guru, Maharaj, are, we have a chain of, of gurus, spiritual teachers, and one guru is, is one. You know, if, if, one, so, if so. one guru is representative of God, spiritual teacher representative of God, of God mm -hmm. truthfully representative of God, then they are, they are the same. But, they are equal but, but, representatives but, 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 of God. But uh, the, the God you, you believe in, There's what's his name? God. What's his name? Ram, Nishringa, Bhagavan, so many names for God, Krishna, so many names for God, hundreds of hundreds. In, in, in Sanskrit language, there are hundreds of names for God. Uh, and Jesus did not mention this one you are talking about. Well, you, you say Almighty God. What language is that? English? <laughs> the Almighty God. If you were speaking Arabic, you might say Allah. If you're speaking Sanskrit, you'd say Ishvara, the Supreme Controller. But, 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 but so the, many names. The, the only difference that you then see that there is a difference is because none of all these have a savior. Only Christianity is coming with a savior. Well, I, I, I would contradict you. Who, and, and who, who, who is the savior in that religion that you are following now? We have so many saintly persons, so many saviors. It, it, for every time, for every age, uh, for every, uh, how for did every they age. How did they prove that, that they, are, they can be trusted? Well, if you read the scriptures, you will find out. You read the, read, we have scriptures such as Srimad Bhagavatam, Bhagavad Purana, vast numbers of scriptures, and, and they describe what the symptoms of a saintly person. They, they, and so many of them perform, Jesus performed miracles. So many, so many of our saintly persons perform amazing miracles. You know, that, that, it, miracles are for the ignorant who won't understand, so then they, they show some magic trick, so they ah, they must be, must be true. So... Okay, so <laughs> anyway, look, I'll, I'll get back to my nice to speak to you. Nice, you know, nice to talking to you. And uh, do you still have your Bible uh, at home? Yeah, yeah, I have you, you, Bible at home. Yes, keep yes. reading, read the book of John. Yeah, nice talking to you. <laughs> Arise and shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. And as you go, preach, saying, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Heal the sick, cleanse the lepers, raise the dead, cast out devils. Freely we have received, freely we give. Arise and shine. For your light has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. And as you go, preach, saying, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Heal the sick, cleanse the lepers, raise the dead, cast out devils. Freely we have received, freely we give. It's time to rise up and be counted. It's time to destroy the works of the devil. Time to transform the nations. There is a cry. Whom shall I send? Who will go for us? Let's all say, send us, Lord. Send us, Lord. Send us.